Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Alhamdulillahirrabbilalamin. Assalatu wassalamu ala asrafil anbiya wal mursalin. Wa alihim wa ashabihim wa firum ya jemaahin amma ba'du. The honorable my reviewers, the honorable my uh, surfisur. Firstly, in the name of Allah, the most gracious, merciful, gracious be to Allah, King of the King, the Lord of this universe, the Master of the Day after He has no partner. Secondly, salawat and salam to our Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam, who has brought us from the darkness to the lightness, from the bad moral to the good moral. And certainly, in this time, or right now, I'm gonna presentations about my thesis proposal okay my title in thesis proposal is review of educating english speakers in culturally relevant manner uh, we conduct to the chapter one in the chapter one i put here five for four first one is background of the study and the second is purpose of the study, mm, the third significance of the study, and the last is purpose of the study. Okay, now first I'm gonna present, I'm gonna explain about the background of the study. The background of the study, uh, the importance of English as a global language, and the role of the speaking in mastering the, the language. And the second is speaking ability. Yeah, speaking speaking ability. We focus on uh, how we focus on the the effective communication and interactive teaching. In the interactive teaching, we focus on the the creative of the technique uh, when the student study. And last is learning challenge. In learning challenge, uh, seldom like uh, the student never 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 practice the new when they study never fract, but never practice what he got when 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 uh, them study. That is the the challenge. Of uh, the learning of Jalan, yeah, sorry. And next, in the chapter one, there is purpose of the study. To determine the most efficient culturally sensitive teaching technique and approach uh, for teaching English speaking to a learn of the language from a variant of culturally background. And there is also to explore the Perception of perception and experience of teach and student regarding the use of culturally responsive teaching and teaching uh, English speaking skill. Yeah. Okay. Next, uh, significance of the study. Theoretical significance with the help of this study English language learn from a variant of culturally background will be able to improve their English speaking abilities more successful yeah first for student yeah this research can uh, provide practical tips for improving their speaking uh, for teacher this study can help teacher teach speaking English in the classroom to a uh, student from varied culturally background and last is for others others researcher to give uh, additional uh, detail so that others school uh, scholars now do similar future research in the in the field and next is in the chapter one, there is a focus of the study. This uh, this study will use culturally responsive 
teaching to analyze the speaking ability of the student. I think only that in the chapter one, we conduct to chapter three. In the chapter three, I put uh, five uh, important as we, we have to know that. First one is research design, and next setting of the study, the next participant of the study, and data collection, and last is that analyze data analyze okay if i'm gonna explain about the experience design we conduct to research design it seems like research complete a qualitative method yeah i use the qualitative methodology to love uh, to improve uh to uh, the, the problem faced by student when speaking english using culturally responsive teaching method there are also choose of qualitative methods in the research uh, with the complexity of the issues studied aim to obtain that directly from the context and participant and conduct to setting of the study the setting of the study referred to the place and time to conduct a study the researcher will be conducted the research uh, the 11 grid of MI Wanul Muslimin Lenet which located at the Jalan Linsa number 65 Lenet Rambandia this is in East Lombok right especially in, in my village okay we conduct the participant of this study in this case the participant of this Research are student of the 11 grade of uh, MI1 Muslimin Lenek in the academy 2023 and 2024. Considering in speaking level which consist of the uh, 20 students, the research will take a classroom as the participant of the research. Okay, okay next we conduct two. Data collecting technique here. Here, there are uh, culturally responsive teaching. Culturally responsive teaching is in inductional strategy that aims to knowledge and blend student cultural diversity in the classroom as well as to, inco to incorporate and respect student culture background in the learning experience okay next there is uh, teaching speaking yeah teaching speaking is activity that helps students who are learn second of origin language to generate the speech so that they can speak effectively effectively and confidently in front of uh, different on each in others okay uh, conduct to uh, technique of collecting debt for data sorry there are uh, there is uh, interview and observation I will explain first is interview the interview is extended learn more about student perception as well as support question with responses in observation the information will be generated through observation the data generated from the observation will be used to further the research this observation will take place when the students are learning english in class yeah, I think it's only that for my explanation in my thesis proposal. I hope uh, I hope you understand what did I said here. Uh, and I just want to say I'm so sorry if I have something wrong. Thank you so much for your attention. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.